All my professional career, I have been working with connections in steel structure. Back in the 90s, I had great opportunity to work on development of component method. It analyzes connection behavior based on experimentally determined parameters of its components and engineering estimation of internal forces distribution in connection. This works great for simple configurations, but it is not working for more complex joints. A new method was needed. Component-based finite element model is a synergy of finite element and component method. Internal forces are calculated by finite element model. Component behavior is calculating using analytical models developed based on experiments. Resulting internal forces inside the joint take into account elastoplastic distribution. In today's construction process, engineers have to work with increasingly complex joints, even in ordinary steel structures. Using simplified assumption of internal forces is not feasible here and leads to extra material usage or risk of construction defect. Component-based finite element model allows to predict behavior of all structural steel joints with the same accuracy and reliability. We are combining two well-accepted methods in the field, component method and finite element method. Design steps are well described and published. We have been explaining CBFEM to professional public right from the start of its development. Validation and verification tests of CBFEM were key part of its process. We have been using system response quantity methodology for checking each component behavior as well as its behavior in joints. We are comparing CBFEM results with component method. Each of six PhD students has been working on verification since 2013. We published over 30 benchmark cases, which clearly show that the results are accurate, safe and comprehensible. As all the cases could not be verified by component method, we validated CBFEM on tests described in professional literature or we also perform our own test. The first step is to create advanced research finite element model and make sure of its correct physical behavior. Then we simplify this model from experimental values to design values. Finally, we compare the results of CBFEM model to these results. The calculation procedure of CBFEM is general and does not depend on national codes, material parameters, analysis and design of bolts, welds and other parts of connection are fully according to selected standard procedure. All the checks fully comply with Eurocode or US code. Don't be afraid, CBFEM is great.